All right, we are Asgard Radio hanging out at Warp Tour, and right now we have Matt Seed Rising, correct? Yep. Yes. Okay. Uh, go ahead and introduce yourselves. I'm Francesca. I sing and scream and stuff. I'm Mason. I play guitar. Did you say and scream and stuff? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so where are you guys from? Uh, we're from Frederick, Maryland. From Maryland? Yes. Wow, don't get them any rock bands from Maryland. That's really cool. Yeah. How long have you guys been together? We've been together for four years. Okay. Touring for three. So Touring for three? Mm-hmm. Okay. And uh, yeah. where have you guys toured at? Where, where have you guys? All across America. Have you? Canada. So what was the, what what made you guys just finally say, fuck it, let's do this and tour? What what, what was that final? Uh, it wasn't really a fuck it kind of thing. It's just like, oh, we can like play a lot of shows like all together <laughs> yeah. like, on one continuous thing. We should do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, we didn't really know what, what it was. We were I was like fourteen when we were touring. Really? Yeah. Well you guys are young. Yeah, yeah. our drummer is fourteen years old. Oh my god. So we started this band when he was ten and we started touring when he was eleven. And then we got signed when we were he was eleven and I was like fifteen. So. Holy cow. So how how kind of surreal was that when you guys started touring and someone said, Hey, you guys are fucking awesome, let's sign you. Um, I don't know. We had a couple of <laughs> I don't really know what like it meant to be signed to a label or anything. I was just like, oh, like there's managers and like contracts and stuff, so that's like kind of legit, you know? It's official. That's yeah. cool. And so we had like inquiries from Epic Records or whatever, and then like some other like independent labels, and then we had like Roadrunner okay. come up to us, and we we're just like, all right, that sounds pretty dope. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah, Roadrunner got a lot of a lot of teams out there that that look for bands and everything. So. Yeah. Dave Rath is our guy. <laughs> so, um, what's uh, after Warp Tour here? What are you guys going to be doing? Uh, we have after today. We have three days left on Warps, and then we drive for two days and start our tour with I Prevail, uh, The White Noise, and My Enemies and I. Okay. And then um, we'll have a break day, like within those days, and we'll be uh, shooting a music video for a new single, Fighting Gravity. So okay. that'll be super cool, and then. That'll eventually lead up to our CD full or full length of release, Awakened Color, at the end of summer. At the end of summer, to be released. Yes. Okay. And what's the label that it's on? Is it under uh, Roadrunner? Roadrunner. Okay. Roadrunner cool. has been there since the start. So. Oh, have they? Yes. That's cool. That is really good. I'm I'm happy for you guys. That, that's really cool to hear. That you know, it, I mean, it, obviously I'm older than you guys are kids to me because I mean my kids are older than you guys. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, but it's really cool that you know that you guys that you guys have been found that you know this young you guys have a long way to go. I mean you guys can be together as long as like you know like Aerosmith. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully you don't. Yeah. Making enough money like Aerosmith. But yeah, would be nice. nice. Yeah. Hopefully I wound up at working at a gas station or something. Yeah, hopefully yeah. <laughs> So what, uh, where do you guys, you know, like, want to go on tour? What, what is, like, your... Uh, UK, and I think my all-time, like, you know, my, my bucket list would be touring in Asia and, okay. like, getting big there, because that's where I'm from. Okay. Philippines. Are you really? Yes. So. We have, we, I do have listeners in the Philippines. Ooh, shout I out do. to you guys. I'm, I got, from, I'm born in Cebu. So. Okay. We have a, a girl who listens, um, I call her my Fili- Filipino uh, princess. Because she's been listening to us since the very beginning, oh, cool. and she is so cool. But the thing is, is when she hangs out with all her friends, she's very white. She's like a very, very white. So it's like yeah. I said, when she told me she was from the Philippines, I'm like, no, you're not. <laughs> I'm like, you're, you move there. She's like, no. She's like, I know, I get it all the time that I'm very white, you know. But but yeah, I just I love that girl to death. She's real. Her name's uh, Johnny, Joni, Joni, and nice. she's just really. And, and, and you know, hey, wherever we can get listeners, that'd be awesome. And, yeah, exactly. You guys going back there to tour, that'd be really cool for you. You have family back there still? Yeah, I have a lot of family back there. Mainly yeah. in Cebu and like Manila. Okay. So those are the biggest cities. Okay. And it's really nice. Um, so, what, your family moved to the States? Yeah, I was about a year old when we came here. We immigrated and stuff. And then um, I became a, a U.S. citizen like three years ago. Okay. So. Well, that's cool. I mean, that's, you have a lot of, uh, that'd be good to have a lot of contacts out there. You just yeah. you'd call them, hey, we're coming out there, come see me. Yeah, sure. I mean, like, I know that, uh, like, any, like, all Filipinos are supportive of other Filipinos, especially mm-hmm. in, the, in the arts. So, like, uh, you know, any band that's actually ever toured the Philippines, even if they're not Filipino, like, like people are fucking crazy there. So, yeah. Like, that'd be super cool. And so imagining, like, you know, them wanting to support another Filipino doing their dream, like, oh, like, that's going to be, like, bigger. 
Yeah. Like, it's going to be like a, I don't know, like, people are going to be like, what the fuck? <laughs> Especially surrounded by three white dudes. Yeah. Like, Filipinos, <laughs> Filipinos, like, love white people. <laughs> that's funny. Maybe that's why they like our radio station. Maybe. Because uh, we're all just Maybe. pure white. Because I'm so white, I can't go out in the sun. I'll just burst into flames. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this face. <laughs> All Filipino girls would be like, oh my god. I don't get it. I don't even like white people. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, is there is there a, a, a tour that somebody can look at, you know, or do you have it announced, you know, where you're going to be? Yes. Uh, everything's out on your uh, yeah. Facebook website. I, I prevail. Like, posted. Yeah. We have stuff on our internet stuff. Okay. So, so. Internet, yeah. Twitter, all the everything's out. Um, yeah. But we do have some tours, hopefully lining up for fall. Can't talk about them of in course. depth. And we're hoping to get something in January, February. But okay. We're not sure. Yet. <laughs> and when's the album? The end of summer. End of summer. Yeah. And what's it called? Awakened Color. Awakened Color. Yes. Okay. At full length. Yes. Okay. Ten songs. And what? Ten songs. Okay. Um, now, Lots of color. when when you when you did your album, did you find it hard to fill it with all the songs? Because when I, I mean, when I grew up, it was albums. You had A side, B side. Mm-hmm. You know, um, now they call them filler songs. You know, because it's. Uh, do you guys, uh, when you guys put out an album, uh, do you guys feel good that it's good through and through? Um, no, this is our first full length, so this is like the first time we're actually doing it. Okay. Um, to me personally, there are like a couple of filler songs that I'm not very happy with because we only wrote 10 songs for this album and like all those 10 songs made it onto the album and it's hard to have 10 out of 10. So I only really like a couple, like, you know, like a handful of them. But, you know, like other people like them. So I mean, like if other people like them, like, Exactly. Then then they'll sell and they'll be money for your door. Yeah. I mean, like the songs that I like, you know, that I love are the ones that I do passionately love and I do really, you know, like put in a lot of work for and then some of the other songs were just kind of like, oh, we're running out of time. We only have like three days left, so we're just going to write it. Okay. <laughs> now, do you have, um, are you guys coming through the Chicago area? I think so. Uh, at least okay. So. okay. Yeah, because the way that I prevails routing is set up is uh, it avoids warp tour. So like warp is on the like, East Coast, they're on the West Coast. Oh, okay. I guess so that's fine. I gotcha. So okay. there, there, there will be people coming out to the shows and <laughs> buying merchandise. And buy the merchandise, don't the forget. Bands. You have to buy the merchandise. They need money to, 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 to tour with. Um, so what time do you guys go on today? 6.30. It's a late show today. Oh, that's good. No, it's not. Well, yeah, because it be, won't be as hot. Well, I mean, we'd rather play in the heat and actually have people come out and watch us and be able to like pick up some merchandise and help support us than like you know, playing for like five people while all the headliners are going on right now, you know, like at the time. Like usually if you're playing late, you're like either competing with like some 41 or Yellow Card or like Newfound Glory or like someone really big. So it's really hard to play. Nah, I think you guys are fine. I do. I think you guys are slots are cool too because other bands can come and watch you. So yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's yeah, like also a nice sacrifice. Yeah, and you guys do a meet and greet after or yeah, after you guys kind of wander around your tent. Yeah. Grab, just grab something to say, hey, come by myself. <laughs> yeah, that's what we do. All right. Well, check them out. Band Sea Rising, right? And uh, Facebook, obviously. Bad Twitter. Bad Rising. Bad Rising. Um, website? BadSeedRisingBand.com. BadSeedRisingBand.com. we got to yes. make sure because a lot of the time, yeah. Yes. BadSeedRisingBand.com. Check them out here at Warped Tour and then go to their page and find out where they're going to be coming up here in the near future and watch for their album at the end of summer. And uh, make sure you guys get it, download it, buy it. Don't matter what it is, just buy it. All right, guys, thank you for thank you for your time. I appreciate yeah, it. You. And I know you guys got a lot of interviews and a lot of shit to go. And I so I don't want to keep you too long. So take care, and uh, hopefully we'll see you down the road. And if you guys are because I'm in Northwest Indiana, so if you guys come out that way, I'll try and get out and come see you guys locally. Cool. All right, we are at Warped Tour here in the uh, sweltering heat at about 120 degrees, and uh, that's why I'm not leaving the building. <laughs> it has no radio.